I'm still in shock at uh, hindi pa rin makapaniwala doon sa, sa balitang gumising sa atin mula kaninang madaling araw hanggang sa ngayon. Wirasak na ni Kobe yung puso ko noong 2008 nung natalo yung Lakers Celtics sa championship nung siya ay nagkaroon ng Achilles injury at uh, syempre nung inanunsyo niya yung retirement niya sa isang kakaibang manner which is pagsulat ng tula na malapit sa atin yung pagsusulat. Kaya siguro even after all those Uh, times and the things that I've said hindi pa rin talaga matutumbasan yung sakit na nangyari kanina dahil iba yun eh, uh, very tragic uh, hindi siya yung ideal na pag-exit ng isang alamat, gaya ni Kobe Bryant uh, Hello uh, I'm new Victor Masoy uh, ano lang, mga, somebody asked me to uh, to share my uh, reaction sa sa death ni Kobe and you know, yung impact niya sa akin as a fan um, ayun, syempre um, masakit yun um, kung pangit na simula ng araw uh, pagising ko yun yung una ko nakita na uh, you know, uh, Kobe together with his daughter Gianna uh, died in a helicopter crash sakit lang kasi syempre you idolize the, the guy growing up you know, ginigaya-gaya ko pa yung uh, galaw niya kung naglalaw ng basketball kahit nga hindi naglalaro kahit dati sa classroom pinapost sa fan ko yung mga mga kaklase ko uh, pero wala yun, ang unfair lang talaga ng buhay na ganun kailangan mm, lahat ng tao alam yun everything that comes to an existence goes out of existence and this is Kobe's life Dear Kobe Thank you for everything. Thank you for inspiring us. Thank you for your motivations. Thank you for your hustle and hard work. Thank you for showing us what perfection looks like. Thank you for your greatness. And thank you for showing us that dreams do come true when you work hard for it. We will surely miss you. Uh, reaction mo nung nalaman mo yung Uh, death ni Kobe Bryant? Uh, Siyempre, sobrang surprise kasi wala nang i-expect kasi na mangyayari. Parang hmm. parang panaginip pa rin lahat. So, an- ano yung ano niya? Yung impact niya sa'yo? Bakit mo siya naging idol? Uh, kasi since siguro mga 6 years old ako, hmm. siya na yung pinapanood ko din. Ang laki ng impact niya based sa perspective and approach to paano ko i-take yung mga bagay sa buhay. Lalo na sa mga problema ngayon, parang based sa mga mentality talaga. Sobrang nakakalungkot po ang pagkawala ng ating idol na si Kobe Bryant at ang kanyang anak na very supportive ni Kobe ng ating idol na talagang minsan hindi na natin lagi sila nakikita mag- magkasama sa lahat ng laro ng anak niyang si Gigi lagi na doon si Kobe ngayon po nawala na po sila pareho sobrang nakakalungkot po at nakakatunaw po ng puso talaga kahit ako uh, nakakapanghina pag naisip natin parang hindi pa rin hanggang ngayon hindi ko matanggap na wala na sila kaya para natiliin ko na uh, si Kobe at ang kanyang anak ay buhay pa rin sa aking isipan dahil kahit na wala na sila sa mundo ang pangalang Black Mamba at 
uh, Kobe Bryant ay hindi kailanman mabubura sa history ng basketball at sa ating mundo. Kaya Idol Kobe Bryant, marami salamat kahit pa paano nakalaro kita, nakabantayan kita, nasyutan mo ko at nakausap mo ko kahit konti lang nasabi mo sa akin nung inusubukan kong stopin ka at depensahan ka at nasyutan mo ko, sinabi mo sa akin, good defense, sobrang tuwan-tuwa ko na yun at, ala, at baong ko yun lagi at alaala ko yun. Kaya marami salamat Idol Kobe, you never fade and uh, I am, I am your number one fan, fan and we love Kobe Bryant. Um, as a basketball fan, sobrang nakakalungkot yung, yung nangyari, yung, yung, yung balita kay, kay Kobe at sa doktor at sa uh, lahat ng pasahero nun sa helicopter na, 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 na sinakyan nila. Uh, yun talaga, sobrang Sobrang unpredictable talaga ng, ng buhay natin. Sobrang ikilan ng buhay natin. Hindi, hindi talaga garantisado yung bukas. So, ayan, kailangan i-enjoy natin yung, yung buhay natin. Ang gawin natin kung ano yung gusto natin gawin sa buhay. As long as wala tayong sinasaktang ibang tao. Wala tayong um, inaapakan. Inaapakan na nagrabiado ng ibang tao. So, Sobrang nakalungkot, sobrang nakalungkot, lalo na sa basketball community. Sobrang laki, laki ng naging impact ni, ni, ni Kobe sa, sa buhay natin. The world of basketball has lost an icon with the passing of Kobe Bryant. His passion for wanting to be the best player ever to play the game, but more importantly, his passion for teaching kids around the world how to play the game correctly is what he will be remembered for and will be his legacy. I had the pleasure of playing with and against his father, Joe Bryant, when I was in college at St. Joe's University in Philadelphia, which is where Kobe was born. It was very clear when Kobe came into this earth that he was going to be a special basketball player and a special person. And all the times that Kobe came to the Philippines and visited the shores of the Philippines, and he came in and did clinics, I was most impressed with the fact that he was the most accommodating superstar that I had ever met. Instead of spending the usual 45 minutes on the court with the kids, teaching them skills, he would be out there over two hours when he really didn't have to. My condolences go out to the family, of course, the wife, Vanessa, uh, the kids, the three girls, and also the parents of Kobe Bryant. Sa atin tayong lahat dahil uh, ibigang ko na wala na ako. Uh, Ganon talaga ang buhay. Pray lang natin. Tapin na natin sana. Pray natin na matanggap ng uh, buong puso ng pamilya. Today is, is one of the saddest days in my lifetime. It seems like a bad, like a bad dream. She just want to wake up from it. It's a nightmare. I know we all feel the same way about such a great, such a great leader, such a great champion, a great person. You got a chance to know Kobe. You got a chance to really know Kobe. Emotions are all over the place. These are the moments of the why. Kobe! Kobe! Kobe!